how to get this gorgeous classic Hollywood look worn by Iris Law. This could possibly be the easiest tutorial ever, so make sure to make it your own wear all of the foundation and all of the concealer and cheek products that you like, but I kept it extremely, extremely simple. I didn't even wear a foundation. I just applied my concealer, which is full coverage, and spot concealed in the center of the face on top of the eyelid and anywhere where I needed to just make sure that I had a little bit of coverage, but it looks like her skin is very natural. I applied my bronzer only on top of the forehead and a little bit on the cheeks. She has her bronzer very high and very far out, close to her temple, so I didn't want to do anything that kind of took away from the lip. That is the star of the show. Very unkept, natural brows. I need something though, so I did a little bit of an eyebrow pencil, but I just kept it really subtle. I did set my face with a translucent powder and my eyelids as well because she has what it looks like to be absolutely no eyeshadow on. So I wanted to make sure that my eyes don't get too oily. Then I started my eye look by just applying my mascara first. This is going to help my very thin tight line to stay put and to not transfer onto my bottom lash line, which is great that I don't want it to transfer. So I just take my thin eyeliner and I place it right in between my eyelashes so just wiggle 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 right into your lashes make sure that you're not lining too much on the inner rim because like i said we don't want it to transfer and we just want it to look like we have super thick lashes and not like we're actually wearing anything on the eye at all i actually do this twice just to make sure because my mascara is still wet so i want to make sure that that eye line is just kind of going right in between those lashes and not sticking anywhere else now I'm going to do the signature red lip. I actually started with a lip tint just to make sure that the red stays ultra vibrant and just really pops off the page. I'm using MAC Marrakesh because it looks like what she has is like a very rusty red. And I love this color. I think it looks good on absolutely everybody. I go back in to clean it up to make sure that it's nice and crisp because like I said, this is the star of the show. So you want to make sure that you're wearing your favorite red, that it looks extra crisp, that you're going back in with your lip liner and really making sure that it's going to stay put, last all day. No feathering, add some gold, little accents with jewelry and enjoy gorgeous 